我哋今日咧整葡挞。平時都係煮嘢多啲嘅，咁煮嘢嗰陣就唔需要留意好多 ，like you know how much measurements this or that. You know, it's all always about like you get a feel of it, right? You get a feel of how much seasoning to put in there, and then you taste it. It's good. It's good. But、um, baking seems a lot more sophisticated. First thing I want to try is definitely how to bake、um, or how to make pastel de nata because it's so hard to find good ones here, and it's just so iconic from Macau. Oh, my leg of pot. Three tablespoons. Okay, I'm really bad at following recipes. I don't have cinnamon stick. We are gonna. Replace it with cinnamon sugar instead. Let's see. Yep, boy, my safe and tea. Yep. Okay. Cup, cup. I hate these measurements. They always like this one. Does, this is from IKEA, so it's not based on cup. It's based on m a m a. It says a quarter cup here, but then up there it says one one and a quarter. Like one time, that's not confusing. This is how much it looks up. ML is. That's a little bit. Trust the process. We shall trust the process. Get the lads out of the way, pretty. Go find me, though. Sense, you know, because like it's trying to get the small like lumps of balls, I guess. So, all right, we're gonna boil the second batch of milk, and I believe this will then mix into the doughy-looking thing that we did earlier. Two hundred milliliters of milk. 好啦，咁咧，而家煲紧呢个奶啦。I don't know if these are the most authentic, but it's what I found in、uh, Nanan Ranch. 正宗葡式蛋塔皮，蛋塔皮。So um, I guess we'll test out how flaky these turn out. Am I doing this right? Like. <laughs> Okay, it said whisk the milk into the mixture. Six large eggs. Totally forgot to turn on the oven. To preheat it, they seem legit. These are like layered. Seems like layered with butter, and I've watched videos that kind of look like that. So exciting to see how this looks. All right, I'm just waiting for the oven to get hot. 去到五百五十度，而家二百五十度。咁咧，哇 ！Look at my setup. It's so cute. So I think actually I could make more than nine. But I really hope this turned out good. I mean, I really didn't put too much effort in it, and it's some random recipe. I feel like I should look harder in a recipe. Maybe even Subtle Asian Baking had it, but I don't know where the book went. And I'll link it below for if you want more baking recipes, Asian-inspired recipes. So. Now it's starting to add some custard to the top. Oh! Okay, so we're gonna put some of the milk in there.
we shall let it cool for a little bit and then and oh so hot it looks it like kind of shrinks after it cools down which i think is normal it smells pretty good pretty smooth whoa Let us try this. <laughs> this is not the taste I was hoping at all. <laughs> what? I mean, the crust is great. <clears throat> But the inside, like the custard, is watery. I think it's also missing milk, maybe, for like the richness, but it's just... Okay, so remember when I was struggling to understand whether the recipe said a cup and a quarter of milk or sugar or of milk or water? That's a little weird. Trust the process. So it turns out it's, yeah, a cup and a quarter, but I just did a quarter instead for the measurements. So I kind of fixed it. I added um, some more water and milk for the recipe. So we're gonna try it again and see if it tastes better. And that's why it was so bland because I was like, like it's not like enough and that makes sense it clicked in my head I do taste the cinnamon sugar that I added, so I'm happy about that. But I want to try next time with a cinnamon stick. And I know some recipes add lemon. But I don't have lemon. Cheers. Mm. Okay, let's see how it tastes. Pretty good. I feel pretty good. Look at that. So you're listening in the sun. <laughs> 